Hello, welcome to iNail Pods. iNail Pod is a complete point of sale system for nail salon, hair salon, and barber shop. To begin, we would like to present you our product line. In order for the iNail Pod to fully functional, you need to equip with the receipt printer and a cash drawer. Additional to the accessory is the card reader. The card reader can be used for credit card transaction, gift card, and membership card. And we also offer the program called Data Safe, the cloud database backup to safeguard your data in case the app accidentally delete from the iPad. And all accessories can be purchased through this iPad. By slide your finger from left to right, select upgrade license. In this panel, you will see we offer a monthly payment plan and then a product selection. A receipt printer is a thermal printer and the cash drawer is connecting to the printer. If you purchase the gift cards and membership cards, one of our professional card designer will contact you for the artwork. Now let me begin the iNail pause. Now from the main screen, the eight preset technician. All technician can be programmed with their personal profile, their contract, and then the pictures. By click on any technician, we we'll jump to the main new screen. The main screen is 100% configurable on your own price. Let's begin to show a quick cash transaction. By going back, select a technician, Cindy. Select a service. And select cash. On the left column is a $5 increment preset and the keypad for you enter the amount. Let's assume customer give you 20. Click 20. That is completion of the cash transaction. Now let's verify the ticket by click admin. Enter your code. At default, the admin code is one two three four, and the manager is zero 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 four zeros. I can click Cindy. Here's the ticket that she's complete. From here, you can have either delete the ticket, void the ticket, or delete the sell item. And look at the payment type, and recount the contract and then look up any ticket that you work with. You can reprint the technician ticket or reprint the customer ticket. Look at all the ticket in the Excel mode. Go over to reports. You will see there's a sale report for today. If you want to go to yesterday, click yesterday, yesterday, yesterday. Here today you go back. If you want to if you want to change certain range, select your week range and your all you then now you look in the week range and back to a week, a week. If you want to go to an 8 by 11 view, the flip page button to cycle the view. And click performance will show a summary of each technician services and tips. Cycle page, you see a detail of technician performance. Now go to payroll to select Cindy. Now you can see a brief. A summary of her service, a payroll contract, cycle page, you see her detail of payrolls. This is the detail of the ticket for this week. Detail of Cindy payroll in the 8 by 11 form. From this view, you can print to the 8 by 11 printer. All the report can be emailed to a recipient. Now let's show you another transaction paid by credit cards. Hit PAM, select the PAM services. Before you complete the credit card transaction, please swipe the customer card on your extra terminal. Once approved, select credit cards. All you ask is for you to enter the last four digit of your credit card number. Click done. And that completes the credit card transaction. Now I'm going to the brief description of the control button on this main screen. 
Over the left, you get the admin. Over to the right, you get the open cache drawer with security. And the next is a customer. This is where you can add, edit, and search customer. We're going to have a separate video just for this. And the next is schedule. Schedule can be made by anyone or by each technician. By double click on the time zone, select the required time, and select the customer. Select a service. If new customer, then select and add new customer. Hit OK. You can create a quick appointment without any detail. By double click, select the time, and click OK. By click on the appointment, then you can modify the appointment information. You can cut, copy, delete, or print, change appointment status, or enter notes. or enter services or enter the customer the bottom is exit the application the, on the right is the change this is when you pay cash the remain change show for your reference the bottom slide is for Add and edit technician. By slide over, now you begin in add edit mode. By select the technician, you can drag and position the technician and click edit to edit her profile. Over the left, you get the technician profile. On the right, you get a contract agreement. You can select desired contract. In the middle uh, is a payroll option. In the bottom is a work schedule. To remove a technician from a job, select tech, change the tech status, click here, then Cindy's gone. To bring Cindy back, select text, turn on, and see back. To add a new technician, click new, enter her information. Jonah and the default contract is 6040. Hit save. Reposition Jonah. When you complete, swipe the slider to the left. This will get you back to the standard mode. Now you can begin Jonah transaction. Now let's show you a brief instruction on the menu screen. Click on anyone. On top, you will see a name of Jonah was selected, a current ticket is number two. When you add a service, the back button is disabled because it's required a, the service needs to be paid. When you add an item, you can undo or you can select and delete. If you want to clear all, select clear all and start all over. Below, you can have either have add extra or you can add tips. And quantity. You can give service discount. In this case, you can have option have either owner or technician provide a discount or the owner only and technician only. We have a complete video to just describe this feature. Select owner, you get to decide to add by percentage or certain amount. Let me add five dollars. 
cash. Next is sell gift certificate. Enter the gift card or gift certificate number. Enter and select the amount. You can use the preset on the right. Enter the desired amount. Above is the customer. You can set the customer for this ticket. The label on to the right is show Mary Joan and her current reward point is zero points. To the bottom left is product. Select blue polish, five dollars. Click OK. Tax only on products. Enter the product discount to here. Ten percent. Complete. That's a brief introduction of I now pass. Please go to the other help section by swiping the, your finger from left to right. Select other training available. Thank you.